find it. It's always the problem with the little micro quads. You never know where they are. Oh yeah, here it is. So one of the the problems on the inductrix, like on yeah, most blade flight controllers, unfortunately, is once you put hotter motors in there and more powerful batteries, the the power plug seems to be a bottleneck. I don't really know why the wires se seem to be thick enough and the, the plug yeah, I should be alright, but I don't know why. Um, replacing the power plugs on these little um, boards helps. Maybe it's just that they're worn out after some time, or maybe they're just not good enough in the first place for more current. You can put just a different plug on there, I mean like a different type of plug, but it's usually already good enough if you just take, for example, when you put the, the cameras onto these quads, they come with a little power plug, and I cut that off anyway to solder this directly to the board, so if you have one of these flying around, just take the stock con the stock connector off and solder this thing to it, and you might be much happier. So when I started flying with the first insane hoop, um, I got very very short flight times, and only the the lightest of batteries, the 150 milliamp batteries that I have. Um, provided some sort of a reasonable flight time. Well, it also was just like 40 to 60 seconds. But since I replaced the um, the connector on this guy here with a different one, where actually I cut one of my charging adapters apart until I figured that I have lots of these here flying around, which I cut off the um, uh, the little cameras, you know, whenever I cut off connectors, they come in a big pile, I don't throw them away. So, yeah, that's what I suggest to use. If you're building a tiny whoop, just uh, use reuse the, the plug that you cut off the camera, and uh, you might get much longer flight times.